ladies and gentlemen, uh, I'm just going to put it this way. I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to put here date, time. This is what it is. Uh, you, you can also see the browser here running real fast. This is just a Firefox. It's the same for that matter with any other browser I would use. Okay, but what's not the same is this thing here. And I have been encountering this kind of Google. You know, this is a Google. Google is the one that creates this. It's not a Lincoln. I seldomly today only I used. It's actually a blogger. It's a Google, the one that does this stuff. Have you ever heard about Pegasus spyware? Pegasus spyware works in exactly similar, same fashion, identical fashion to your Google account. To your Google or to your Facebook account. Pegasus virus will modify not only your browser but your entire computer. The only thing you would have to do is you would have to enter some kind of web address. Let's just see where it says right now Wikipedia, something like this. And then what you would do is on device which you got a hold of you would go and you would click through the be uh, through the web browser in this case you see a firefox in this case you see opera let's say the web browser would then update not only web browser but entire computer with a spyware this spyware would then ruin actually rule your life rule your life no this stuff was developed by the israelis the thing is that everybody in the world has it. it doesn't have to be anything related to israelis everybody has it everybody around the world this is not 2016 this stuff has been around for much much longer much longer this stuff has been around probably since probably even 2006 well, what you see here, this kind of stuff, this, you see how this thing is spinning and spinning and spinning and spinning and spinning. And it won't only modify your browser, so the browser is not going to work, because right now this is very inconvenient. I am just trying to adjust a simple thing, a blogger. And what happens is, just so you were able to see a little bit ago, a browser loses touch with the internet. But it's not only a browser that loses the touch, the inter, uh, touch with the internet. Americans, Germans, Britons disconnect the computer from internet at their will, whenever the hell they want. And I believe they actually modify pretty much even my blog to get a hold of it. I think they do a lot of stuff that I don't do, that it's being done, software is being modified in the computer and so on. Well, this is what not Pegasus will do, but God knows how many programs does NSA USA has that are being used to crash your computer and pretty much turn one into a zombie. It doesn't have to be a particular place. It's enough that it's a government-controlled company, such as Google. In this computer, pay attention to what I'm going to state. I've never gone to a Facebook, which I have considered for the one doing this kind of stuff to my browsers. This, this kind of stuff, you see this? Twisting, 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 turning. And you're never going to reach... It becomes, it slows down your computer to the point it's going to take 10, 15 minutes before the page is going to load itself. It won't go. It won't go anywhere. Anywhere you click, it won't go. Just like this.
it basically kills the page somehow. It feels like as if the page would lose the contact with feels as if page would lose the contact with the internet and would not be in touch with the internet. I have seen this on every computer of mine. What's interesting is these are original Windows. This is original Windows. Computer with original Windows. I bought this computer. It's with original Windows. Uh, it's a pretty fast computer. It's not exactly that this computer would be experiencing some kind of down, something that this would be some kind of trash or something like this that would not be capable to follow on. Uh, <laughs> I'm thinking about, but this is a 2.7 gigahertz about something like computer. Hmm, not very keen to demonstrate you this kind of stuff. Uh, because there's a key there, and I don't want to demonstrate key. That's one of the things I am not going to do. Heh, there is no pause button here. But you're going to have to believe me, this is about a 2.7 gigahertz, 8 gigabyte RAM uh, a laptop. Nothing really wrong with it. It's fast. It's good. But then again, it does have the same problem. Running on solid state hard drive, fast hard drive, it does have a tremendous problem connecting itself to the internet. Through the particular browsers, only through the browsers that just as it told me under MK Ultra, you're gonna use the most. You understand? Have I installed here anything special that I would say that's like something special that is installed? Nothing really. That's why I know for fact that's all there is installed here. Look. These are three extensions, add plus, add block, and U block origin. That's all there is, but this is the browser you always use. And it's pretty much what I was told the case is going to be. Whenever, whatever browser you're going to be using, it doesn't matter whether that's going to be a Commodore, or whatever kind of browser you're going to do. With whatever security features, we're going to do exactly what you see here. It's going to be exactly like this. It was hell over the course of the years. One hour of movie on the Windows Live Movie Maker, it would create the files with a size resolution of 7 1280 by 720 678 gigabyte size one one file once the movie was about 12 gigabytes something like this it will burn them for about six or more hours at a time so that i could produce the movie on uh on the internet that that's the kind of stuff we are talking about so then uh, what I would do is I would just use, I didn't know what went on, that's why I walk with a computer, leaving the computer behind uh, results with destroyed, broken, vandalized computer. Uh, and if you leave, uh, if I would leave, God forbid, operating system, basically hard drive with operating system installed on one, then you're dead. I mean, this is, this is when it becomes a nightmare. That's when they install, that's what, what they do, what they have done here in Slovenia to me with a computer, this is just... They did it to themselves. You understand? They did it to themselves. I don't know what I would say to that. But there is nothing special on here. There is nothing installed on here. There is, I'm not using the VPN or anything like this. Look, accessibility. I'm not using anything. I'm not using learn about keyboard shortcuts. Nah, 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 there's 12. Uh, 
I alone have installed this stuff here. Here's a version. It's a 32-bit. Uh, it's Microsoft Edge. I installed one from the Microsoft Edge. And these are original Windows. This is not a copy or anything like this. I am trying to pull out this stuff here. I'm going to do is going to be something like this so it's because I want to see this stuff here VPN proxy settings something in that sense open your proxy settings and I don't have any that is the point here you know as far as security I uh, learned that there is no way you can adjust the custom level here that is true uh, a custom level should open another window that would give you selection uh, as far as the local internet trust aside it's always the same thing you wouldn't allow me to use the custom level as you see I can only use default level and custom level it appears to me already is chosen for me this allowing me to interfere with whatever custom level is so that means it's something programmed I think inside what this shit is it's not good I did observe must say <laughs> no. um I did observe internet disconnection. I did. I must say I I did observe internet disconnection here and there. And the computer would disconnect itself automatically from internet. So that's also very, very uh, unusual stuff to me. But this 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 stuff this is something I have been encountering I'm going to tell you since I started using computer here in Slovenia but that doesn't really mean absolutely anything but yeah here in Slovenia since 2006 is this stuff that's been going on but it's just too many issues but this stuff this stuff is from United States of America. This is not from Slovenia, this stuff here. This stuff, you do connect this to a Google blogger platform or Facebook. Because I don't go anywhere else for that matter that I would go regularly and log myself in. And you can also see here, there are profiles that you list here under your account. You, you put your names on here. No. You got your profiles. You know, I believe under your profiles what it does it just reprograms itself to whatever. And this is you're talking about the Google profiles. So that's the stuff that it appears to me. Maybe I'm even pleased. Um I know now it's not only restricted to Facebook because Facebook ladies and gentlemen never ever was 
installed on this hard drive not mine never ever have I had a Facebook on this hard drive as I think the Facebook this is always whenever I used Facebook things went from bad to shit within days like it was just like you would connect yourself to some kind of crap that then you would go and you would restart the computer and the uh, computer would be something different I, I don't I don't even allow one to this hard drive I don't even dare to visit Facebook page with this computer but it's the same thing that's been done I believe through the Google it took me a little longer it took longer this time because I didn't go to the Facebook uh, but the results are becoming astonishingly similar to symptoms of computer connected to the Facebook it's not good This is a pretty good computer. This is a uh, Hewlett Packard Elite book. It's fast. It's good. Um, no, I just I don't have anything other I would say to to. I could. Uh, I'm thinking about. If I demonstrate to you under Google, uh, if it's going to connect, it does, it modifies exactly the news, it demonstrates the news that wants to demonstrate this crap. Uh, it does exactly whatever is like convenient. it will demonstrate exactly whatever is convenient per per whomever whoever controls this computer that's how it goes it's a crap no. as you see look at it you don't get the page you would like to visit it's twisting it's curling around up there um, but it will demonstrate you shit that wants you to see one. That's the way it is. Yeah. So it basically destroyed the browser. It, I was taught actually specifically when you're going to load the browser with a passwords. That's when we're going to go and destroy you the browser. That's when you're going to have this kind of stuff going on. Okay. So that's that. That's what this is. No. no, nothing wrong with the internet. Nothing wrong with uh, absolutely anything. It's fast. It's very good. But this here, this here sucks. No. Look at that. I cannot even actually demonstrate you what Google accounts I'm logged in. Not even this I can demonstrate you. No, there you go. I can't even demonstrate you what Google accounts I'm logged in. That sucks. Okay. So, you know, let me demonstrate you what exactly Google accounts, anyways, I'm logged in. No, then you're not going to think that I'm baloney or something like that. There you have a whole bunch of this. You got one, two, three, four, five Google accounts I'm logged in. Okay, I'm not lying to you. It's just a, a browser, it's that's what they do. And it's always the same shit. Ah.
There you go. That's that.